I guess we are waiting for people to ready themselves up. Um, and we are going to get into the full-on action in a moment or two. Um, yep. Or two or four. Uh, but before we do Stop that, then. gents, um, who do we think is going to take this win? Ooh, um, I'm going to be biased because all, almost all the people on Team Shine are on my friends list. I'm going to be biased and say they're, they're pretty cool. They're going to do it. I have the exact same bias. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it looks like we're readying up now. I just want to put it out there. I reckon Sleepy Squad's going to take it. So uh, over to you uh, to do the uh, rollout X time. Let's let's see what you got. Yeah, uh, real quick too. I think uh, Sleep Squad got a good chance, but I'm I'm really excited about this because uh, Shining Sombrero has played super strong as well. So as this best of three gets underway. Uh, it really is all open here, but uh, Happy Purple does go down. That's a pretty big early loss, although on the other side is a Happy Weapons guy, which is uh, almost of uh, similar magnitude here. So uh, things still pretty open here. Uh, Nyan with the Huntsman, Chloe Mo, uh, Mew, uh, she's got the shotgun out. Not always the most common uh, pirate secondary, but quite effective. We are going to get the capture underway here. Benny with a Conquer as well. Banners, a uh, very good option on product. Yeah, it seems to be the most tentative capture I've seen of this map so far. Yeah. Uh, really, the blue team not quite wanting to commit themselves to fully and wholeheartedly do that. But while the red team is hiding out in their little bunker, uh, it doesn't seem like it really makes any difference. Was that a flaming arrow I saw then? Uh, yeah, yeah it might be. Nyan. Oh yeah, well Taki is on Huntsman as well. I am sort of surprised on uh, Ost being so far behind on the Uber charge. I didn't think Ost went down there. The Jurati comes in and that causes the instant Uber pop. They uh, don't like being covered in the PP. They say, get it off me. And uh, they're actually going to then put themselves in quite a bit of trouble here as Sergeant Pinecone uh, is easy pickings for Happy Purple. Uh, Versity, the spy, also gets discovered in, in the midst of this. So with their uh, flanks secured, Red Team starting to get in position behind the rock and on the point. Getting the capture here, resting it away from blue team uh, after they've held it for a minute. Yeah, Peter Scott did a pretty good job of getting himself out of that action as, as fast as humanly possible. Uh, and now with the, uh, with neither team really having an advantage, but it does seem like it's, it's a bit of a push me, pull me. Uh, one team uh, takes the, the position, but doesn't actually want to push all the way forward. Mm -hmm. Is that a bit of spy action there? There we go, backstab. Yeah, that was a good uh, backstab. Proctato also like really taking his time make sure that he got the target that he wanted. Um, Sir Duck also going down, so um, Blue uh, a little missing a few players, but considering they're trying to push forward here, it's, it's not the end of the world. Uh, air shot attempt by Zulu Man uh, does miss. He gets taken out by Mort uh, before he can get out. Um, Proctato taking out uh, the heavy weapons guy again. Red is used. And uh, yeah, not, they do get the kill on he Benny. They don't get the yet. Yeah, Peter Scrap's doing a good job holding there. They're not really pressuring into him. Um, although Sir Duck's in some trouble here, using on the engineer. Lazy oh, oh no! no! Oh, it's a drop! Oh, pop it, don't drop it, bro. Trying to trying to spend all day uh, milking it, and you know that's just not productive. That's just not productive. Yeah, there's no cows out here on this particular game platform. Peter Scrap's going down there. It's such a terrible waste. Lazy Purple got on to also kill the Heavy Weapons guy on top of that. So uh, not only do they have Nova, they have uh, a a quite a few people coming out of spawn just now. Oh, Peter Scraps goes down again. Combined fire from Lazy Pur Purple and Proctato. This, and this is going to be a full Uber ad for Red now. Yeah, and especially on Koth maps, this, uh, the Uber charge is so crucial. This so, dynamic is really important, and we'll see if Blue kind of, you know, respond in a typical fashion, which is just send a bunch of four players in a sacrifice wave while keeping your medic alive. But uh, it's not really much of a sack wave. Okay, they do get the pop, though. Okay. Uh, but Peter Scraps yeah. gets killed again. Oh, come on, Peter. You can do this, man. I've got money riding on this. Not really. I don't do that. <laughs> I, I have ice money. cream riding on it. I, yes, I have <laughs> ice cream riding on this. Please, man. Need that money, uh, goodness. You, you might have been sleeping on the uh, right squad to uh, put your ice cream on was because the uh, sleep squad are killing pun. it. Was that, that, that was. damned pop? Get, yeah. I'm leaving. <laughs> Yay, we did it. Wait, <laughs> no, I'm staying. 
Oh, that P, that P landed so early say, on the Would you say he got punted? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I'm not filling in the gaps. I'm too busy crying. Uh, yeah, but my friends were my friends. Yeah, you're, you're shining sombreros, though. Are making a bit of a comeback here. Uh, they need to get the capture, although, as soon as they get the Spry capture. Spry just now. Yeah, yeah Arctado just going too strong. Um, more trying to get in here. Oh, not even going to make oh, it in time. Oh, not quite. He gets closed. You, you have mind. to try for it, though. Yeah. Oh, of course. Of course. Okay, Solo Light, got to ask a question. If you're playing on the blue team right now, if you were playing for your friends out there with these Shining Sombreros, what would, what would you be advising them to do? Uh, I'm not sure, to be honest. And I think that is the advice they've taken to heart. The so advice not oh, to come on. <laughs> that was the Just easiest question with the easiest answer for don't you, Solo Light. Easy. It was Demo Knight TF2. That was the answer. You were set up. Come on. Easy, man. Easy. I just want to point out, Proctio is behind the enemy team already. First oh, first team. Team. Oh, no. oh, oh, Proctio got the backstab on Fierce Scrap. He's gone. He's absolutely yeah. annihilated. He's dead. Doesn't matter. Rest of the team, the red team is looking like they are wondering where the rest of their team has gone. Versity did a lot of effective damage right then. If they can get this pop as well, then they've totally completed the trifecta of awesomeness. Fierce Scrap yeah, did die, though, so red is going to have about 70% Uber advantage. Yeah, exactly. That's what it comes down to is uh, keeping Oast alive here and just getting into a good position where in the next 15 seconds, then they can push in um, with a, with Ubercharge advantage. Speaking of Ubercharge advantage, Red Team's about to have their Uber ready right now. As and we they've were talking, used it. And they popped it on Easy Purple. He goes round. He is causing havoc. Again, oh, backed yeah. up by the Pyro Satan as well. Yeah, Mort gets a choke, oh. choke slam. The entire team getting destroyed here. Dear Lord. So, uh, yeah, there's that, the weather. That's, that, that's really hurting. You can see this blue team is thinking, what on earth are we supposed to do now? Versity is pushing in on his own, as he should be doing. But, uh, let's see if he can find himself in a good position. I think, was he, did he avoid the pyro just then? Oh! Spawn on the side. Yeah, Zulu I'm Man so with a nice bomb in there. They get the kill on Peter Scraps. Uh, also, Benny, also Chloe Muse. Uh, Zulu Man still going. There's some help from the Pyro uh, and the uh, uh, Sniper there as well. Both Snipers oh, on the Huntsman. Oh, will Ooh. shit completely. What an opportunity wasted there. I think he... Uh, uh, he, he got, got the Medic. medic. Yeah, he got, got the, the Medic. medic. Got the medic, he landed. He landed in a position that was so full of enemies. There was almost no one he could kill. Oh, oh, yeah. 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 Uh, pro Protato, Protato uh, takes down uh, the the medic. So uh, no medic advantage for either team, really. Yeah, Proctato also got a kill on the soldier there, Benny. It's quite nice. Uh, right now, Sergeant Pinko though on the point, trying to just spit out some damage. He's going to get killed by the uh, Tomislav heavy of a uh, circuit. Pyro Joe trying to fight on the side connector. Will they be able to ch chase down Zulu Man and finish off the uh, sniper? So Pyro Joe going pretty crazy here. And the Mints of a quick three uh, three kill spree. Might be able to pick up a few more. Lazy Purple trying to shove him backwards, but Pyro Joe playing pretty smart. Oh, Lazy Purple does get Sir Duck on the side. He's trying to get over that health back as well. Oh, no, not. No, he did steal it. Just lost that health uh, pretty instantly right afterwards. Yeah, pretty crazy moves by Lazy Purple, but uh, yeah, definitely did enough to, to confuse the enemy team and, and, and maybe uh, put them on the back foot a little bit. But uh, it looks like they're pushing in now. Sir, Sir Ket uh, is, uh, is hanging around, uh, waiting for an opportunity to push in against this blue team. Yeah, Chloe Mew, yeah, she's the only one holding the point right now. Um, the soldier trying to spam her. She's got the reflex, but uh, also getting kind of low on health. Dealing Medic's some rotating in, though. Yeah, more definitely um, doing some work. Uh, on that uh, heavy weapons guy. He just did a ton to that pyro. Yeah. Yeah, I got a pipe on uh, Lazy Purple, but it will be Oltaki taken down more with an arrow. Sergeant Pineco down as well. Those are two key players for the defense here. Uh, but uh, Happy Purple juggled, and the Uber Charge uh, has to come out there. Chloe Muse staying in her position on the um, point side of Rock there, but a Happy Weapons guy coming from behind. First, he is in a, a position to uh, get some stabs here in a second, but Red Team will be able to capture the point. It's a close round. I'm not sure what Peter Scrap's doing, gotta separate from his team. If there's any time to Uber, I figured it would have been now, but... No, don't... Okay, he gets forced. They have to go in. 
Yeah, I mean, yep. Overcharge is one of those things that uh, obviously you need to protect it, but you, you need to use it. And sometimes if you're just waiting too long, the perfect opportunity, uh, it ends up not coming very cleanly. P Peter Straps also being forced to kind of bounce around ends up just showing his back to the uh, soldier and uh, uh, several other players on the red team. So he got cleaned up here. There goes Pinecone as well. So even though they just captured the point, I think the blue team going to be losing it. Yeah, Sergeant Pinecone jumped in there whilst he was covered in oh. pee without much help as well. Uh, that was kind of a suicide move, but he still managed to be uh, at least a little bit effective before his uh, inevitable demise. Demise? Demise. It's the spies. Yeah. They're getting me confised. <laughs> Freestyling over here, Agro. Let's try not to do that again. <laughs> Benny with the uh, whip kill on Proctato. Um, Blue has most of their players um, together. Uh, more going to be charging through some uh, fireworks to get back to the point uh, quickly Tom's into the match in. and the action. Another jar of P makes its way out onto the blue team. Is it, uh, is it reflected? Did, did we see a reflection of a piss jar then? I mean, if, that, if that happens, that was glorious. I'm, I'm gonna have to wait for the uh, the action slow mo replay um, that will happen in three or four days. Right. <laughs> I'll let you know what happened then. We are counting down the timer right now. Five seconds to go. Red team, are they going to take their second point? They're pretty much healthy on the point right now. There's nobody really... Oh my God, tell a lie. There is a blue team, an uber blue team on that point. They are not willing to let it go without a fight. Sergeant Pinecone is oh, out on his own territory. That is like a ravenous pack of dogs surrounding yeah. their prey. Dear God. All sides circling on them. Absolutely destroyed. That uber isn't going to help. Right, yeah, so good rounds. Good. GG is thrown out as well, but we do have one more round here, so hopefully nobody's uh, slow on the rollout layout. Looks like everybody is aware that we are playing first to three here. Nice close round on that last one, though. We'll see how things open up here, which team might be able to get that uh, all-important first blood. Chloe Mew going down early. Um, Pyro is sort of kind of a cornerstone of defense, although more Sergeant, Sergeant Pinecone and Peter Scraps. Oh, man, it's... Uh, frags coming from all sorts of directions from red team, but now they're just starting to clean up the, the remaining players. Pyro Joe and Benny do stay alive, but both weak on health, not really able to fight forward. Um, Ost, uh, oh, I guess must have just respawned. Um, so I guess Ost did go down somewhere in there. Yeah, okay, Benny did get a successful bomb on the uh, medic, so a little bit of a silver lining there. But uh, medic's up with basically the same charge right now. Yeah, I'm watching uh, Benny right now. Is is that some sort of uh, conch? Is that is that the one that gives the health? He's uh, he's, he's waiting. Yeah, yeah. He's ready to yeah. go, and, and he loses gone. it. I think that's a severe case of uh, blow the conch, don't hold it. Is that is that a phrase that people use in tier two? <laughs> uh, I, like I guess. No lip service uh, is to be utilised on that conch. I'm seeing a pyro though. Is that Firsty hanging out in the background? Or is it Proctato? It's Versity. Proctato is on fire. Well, he manages to get up. Yeah, so. the, the key here is that Peter Scraps has been uh, kept alive and has a charge, well, most of the way. 95% um, right now. These are the times, though, that I feel most nervous about it. And uh, with Sergeant Pinecone, in this situation, they should just be able to drop onto the point. Still don't really find too many people with it directly. Happy Purple is there. Other players um, kind of getting bounced around. Uh, Red Team O does have uh, their medic. And the uh, Sleep Squad will pop it here. Keeping up Austin Richie alive. Needs to... Oh, okay, never mind. I was going to say Flash, Happy Purple, but they kill that Happy Weapons guy anyways. So no capture goes underway. And uh, Peter Scraps in the pocket, as we call that little area right below Cliff. And... Oh... Uh, yeah. Oh, does get away with Nyan coming in with the arrow support. And then gets the health back. Nice play by Peter Scraps. Yeah, we're taking up very slight. Very slight advantage there for, for Peter, Snap, uh, Peter Scraps. Peter Snaps almost. Uh, he's uh, he's still in there with a the chance. Although the ticker is going down quite steadily for the red team. Uh, just one minute left if we're to believe the timer on its own. If, uh, if the blue team is going to make a move, they're going to mm -hmm. do it now. Also be a no time move into. Yeah. Soldier and Medic got covered in the PP there, which actually allowed Sir Duck to shotgun Ost down from range. 
So now without heals, Red Team just standing desperately on the point. They're gonna get the uh, Uber Charge popped out here. Um, so this situation's like, you know, not terrible for them. I mean, obviously they just lost the point, but everybody's gonna be spawning on basically the same wave, and uh, they have three minutes with uh, to, to work with here, so. Uh, they just need to heal their heavy weapons guy back up, and then everybody's going to be uh, feeling good about pushing forward here. I would argue it's three minutes and two rounds to, to, to chill out. Uh, I don't I don't think they're going to be pushing themselves into any kind of position of adversity. Uh, although, having said that, it's a little bit of fun, this map. It's a bit of... Uh, it's for charity. Wow, so, uh, yeah. let's see what they manage. Well, Nyan manages an arrow through the head of Ost. That's going to help out quite a bit, especially after the backstab of Circuit right before that. So Red Team's uh, uh, attempts to get forward here a little bit stifled. Peter Scraps will have an Uber Charge and uh, did get some uh, health there, I think from a sandwich. So um, doesn't really need to use it here, but it might be smart to just you know use it to try yes, and kill the medic and get forward. There it is. Now. Yeah. Yes, he's yeah, they need they needed to at some point. It was a good time to try to press the advantage here. But they need oh, to get frax with it. They are getting some, but uh, now losing Pyro, Sir Chalk, Benny. Sir Chalk, Chalk, excuse me. Yeah, potato uh, covered in the PP, but it does get out. get out of your house, yeah. Nice rotation from him. Six health. Uh, Versity, though, gets a kill. Also, Neon, uh, another arrow in a Zulu, man. Uh, that's over on uh, stair side. Might actually be able to creep out and find something a bit more interesting, but chooses to rotate back. Did see a bit of spy on spy action there. Poctato taking up Versity. Uh, I don't think uh, that's the last thing you do expect uh, is a backstab when you're a spy. Right. There's, only, there's only two knives in the field and one is in your hand. Um, there's a pretty good chance that you're not going to get stabbed, but uh, that's how it played out. And Pocteta Pocteta's went from... Play. No, he gets caught out instantly. Unfortunately, I didn't get a chance to say that he went from the beautiful 69 health uh, down to 109 health, down to nothing. So, uh, unfortunately, nice. Pocteta. Nice. Thank you. Chat, you know what to do. Come on, chat. <laughs> that one's either was nice, he's in chat for the 69 HP. Do it for charity, come on. Thank you very much. Yeah, Red Team with control of the point here. 20 seconds left on the clock. And um, nice control. And good good players up that need to be. Okay, Although another points. arrow comes through. It's uh, yeah, all, all, of the, all of the skill shots coming out here. It was Proctato the spy getting killed by the Telefrag, so that is right here. Being a little too cheeky. And blue team is able to get a few players on the point here, but it's, wow, just, gonna, yeah, be it's it, gonna be real tough though. No, I don't think so. Zulu Man gets two. Still oh, alive with just a point. sliver. Ooh. Yeah. They have kills though, they have an NG here, they have even they have Proctato. He's got the revolver out. Here comes Sergeant Pinecone. He's not going to be willing to let this go. He knows there's a space behind him, though. He can't be hanging out too much. Uh, but he's firing forward. He's getting into the pyro, oh, but he goes out with his efforts. Oh, uh, taking out that little last Red chunk of health there. Running in as well. But he himself gets taken out by Pyro Jewel. Yeah, Versity out here with the revolver. Can't get enough done, but was pretty scary for a little bit there. Pyro Joe, very weak health. It's going to be Grandpa's mini that actually gets the kill on him. And there you go. 3-0 on product in favor of the Sleep Squad. Can I change my answer from the start of the match? <laughs> <laughs> You can, but you'll lose your friends. I don't need friends, I need results. Wow. Welcome to the corporate ladder. You'll, you'll uh, fit out here. Perfect. That's what I want. So, is that it, or are we going to see another match out of these guys? Uh, I believe there's two, two more maps. Two more maps. Two more maps. Damn. Do you know, when you said best of three before, I was thinking that's the... I mean, they've they played three rounds. That was the best of three. We know who the winner is going to be with best this. Best of three, best of three. Best of three, best of three. That's the, the best of nine. On payload. That, 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 best of three, best of five, then payload. I'm, wait, I'm glad, I'm on, glad wait, we had this wait, conversation. I'm more wait, confused wait, wait, than I was on, before right, we started. Hold, hold on. So is it best of three? Then is it a best of five and then it's a payload? Or is the payload best of three? How do you do best of three on a payload? I thought it was like fastest time to cap. Uh, this this, this entire getting, conversation is in my head right now. I tell you what, that, we'll just commentate what happens. We don't really care about the, the details. Let's be honest. We just want to see we, some explosions and stuff. And not only that, we want to see some donations from you wonderful folks because we are doing this not for our entertainment, mostly. Uh, more importantly, we are doing this for Special Effect, which is a charity organization. 
that helps out those less fortunate than us with disabilities and such to play video games to the potential that we can with modified controllers, different input accesses, etc. Uh, that is very important for connecting them with their families, with friends, and like generally a really good cause. If you tape, if, if you tape, if you type exclamation mark charity, you'll find more information about it. If you type exclamation mark donate, you will get a donation link right there. We may have hit the goal, but there is more on the way. We've hit the goal of 1,500, so we will have a community server set up. I believe that was the incentive for 1,500. So please do consider donating. It's a fantastic cause, definitely, in this charitable time of giving. Thank you very much. The way I understand it, if we manage to reach the ridiculously long stretch goal of uh, just two over two thousand and something dollars, then you'll be strapped to a virtual reality machine for twelve oh, hours straight. I was, um, uh, I was having, actually not going to mention that, but yes, it, is that, we, that is yes. Uh, is, that, is that one of those things that you say? I'll do this thing because this amount of money will never be yes, reached. But then, it was. But then, Hold but on, then oh, the closer yeah. you get to it, the more you regret. <laughs> yes. Um, the uh, <laughs> God damn it! Why did you see anything? It's, it's gonna be like it's gonna be a like lawnmower man all over again. The, uh, that eighties TV, eighties uh, <laughs> film. The uh, the goal is one hundred fifty percent. You're a genius, but uh, you'll be having to mow people's lawns. Yes. So yeah, yeah. the 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 goal is two thousand two hundred fifty dollars. Uh, where I will do a twelve hour stream of VR Minecraft and any donations and such affect the game by spawning things and having a wild I, control in the weather etc i will i mean i've already donated a little bit of money but i, I will put another uh, another sock full of money in if you can oh. guarantee that you'll do the 12 hour, the 12 hour virtual reality minecraft stream um and and if you if you need to take a pee break you've got to wear the virtual reality helmet so oh. I, I, I mean i guess that means oh, like no. just i, I just do take want more money for the you. charity i do want more money for the you know what? Good. Deal. The wire's long enough. Excellent. I'll I mean, do I, don't, I don't want to hear it. I just, I just want to no, know no, no, that no, you're no, suffering through be, that pain. The, the microphone that I stream with won't be connected to it. But Excellent. yes. Yeah. Uh, if you donate more money right now, Agro, like, I will wear the it's, headset it's, if I need it's a pee break. Not, I, it's not, not necessarily having a pee break, but, like, but you'll be there in the virtual reality, in that virtual world for 12 <laughs> straight hours. There yes, will be never no takes break. Off. No break. Yes. I, I, 12 I wanna see, hours. I want to see you eating jam sandwiches and eating ice cream with a virtual reality helmet on where you cannot see your oh, face or mouth God, I've or really spoon. stuck my foot in it, haven't I? Yeah, and, and yeah, your face okay. in it. Deal. Deal. Sweet. Okay. I mean, let me, let me dig out uh, the old money bag and, and throw a few more coins in the general direction of your face. Deal. But we're still not going to hit the goal for me to do it in the first place, so... Uh... Chat, you know what to do. <laughs> No, 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 no. We've already made a lot of money. Thank you all very much. Uh, some more, but just below the goal, please. Like, about one cent below it. Please, I don't want to suffer. Nah, blow it out of the water. <laughs> Stop encouraging them. <laughs> oh, okay, but right now, we are on... This is Upward, isn't it? Yes, I know this map. I've played it once. I've heard of it. I've heard of Upward. Upward's a thing. I'm just waiting to hear that notification from Agro's donation. Uh, <laughs> so, X thing, what do you think is going to happen here? Uh, I think the Sleep Squad are going to just continue to crush. I mean, it's a, it's a different map. It's a different set of circumstances. Um, you know, Peter Scraps um, uh, might be able to stay alive a little bit better, but uh, I don't know. Red Team just were playing um, super tight, and I think that that's just going to continue. Awesome. What about you, Solar Light? What do you think? Hmm, big thinking. Awesome. Mm. Thank you. Uh, any <laughs> 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 I'm not sure at the moment. Hmm. Not sure at the moment. You want to see a little bit of the foot in the door to see what's going to happen. Get a little taste of what, what's happening. Sure. All right. That's fair. I can respect that. I can respect that entirely. You know what? I think we will break away to a quick video just while things are a bit quiet. While uh, people are getting the hang of what they're doing. A little bit of grasp of the map. So we'll see you in a moment. Although before we switch, we just got the nation notification. 
which was wow, seventy pounds, seventy pence from Agro. Thank you. And he says, "Blow this out your blowhole." Um, he really wants to like see me not get out of the VR headset. So uh, that takes our total up to one thousand seven hundred sixteen dollars and ninety one cents. I think you'll find it's one thousand eight hundred and eleven dollars eleven and sixteen cents. I think you need to do the oh, wow. F5 on that screen. Yeah, no, I do. I do. You're right. I had to F5 twice, despite the fact I saw let's, your uh, I saw your note for Kate. That was weird. Uh, the anyway, less yeah. less than 700 bucks away from you spending half a day in was, in, in a I different saw, world to the reality. Hold on. Is it as much as that? I'm sure it was only 225. Oh, really? Of course, doing this all for special effect. Just a little bit of info video there. If you type exclamation mark donate, you will be given a donation link. Please do check that out if you can. If you cannot, please do spread the word. Every little bit does help. We have one last incentive to reach, which is one thousand two hundred and fifty dollars. Uh, sorry, two thousand two hundred fifty dollars. Uh, I swear I can count. Numbers are a thing I can do, believe it or not. Uh, a little groan of uh, probably disagreement from Agro there. Uh, <laughs> Christ knows. I think, I think you're numbering about as well as I'm talking right now. But uh, nonetheless, oh, uh, we have with us uh, Solar Light. Uh, it's a, a wonderful opportunity to sort of um, question you on, on what it takes to be Demo Man TF2. Is it hundreds of hours Demo of Demo Man? TF2. Demo Knight, my apologies. Yeah, you... How oh dear. How, how dare oh. I even think uh, to, to talk to such a fellow as you, uh, solo like Demo Knight TF2, otherwise known as... Uh, what, what makes a great Demo Knight? A lot of practice. A, a, very, a very extreme amount of practice trying to trim around the map, at least. That's what I tend to do. Well, yeah, it seems the, the setup time has begun. Excellent. Oh, yeah, sure, why not? Well, like, I might as well talk about the trimps. So, um, Output has a lot of really, really massive trimps. Like, this is one of the reasons why I think Output is my favorite map in the entire game, just because I can still load up the map offline, trimp around for a bit, and then maybe discover some obscure trimp that I've never found out before. What would you do if, like, uh, Demo Knight just flew through the sky and just all of a sudden all you hear is, like, Pirate Lord going, yeah, and then he just cuts off your head and flies away? Uh, I, would I would respect him. Also, I got asked to let out a yar, so I, I, that, that, that was it. It was a, it was a, it was a coy. It was a, it was a fake question. It was all fake. It was the new one. Is, isn't life fake? Yeah, life isn't real. This is, this is all a dream. A wonderful dream during this wonderful time of year. Man is the dream of the dolphin. Mm, looks like we're about to start as well. What, any predictions, you guys? Any at all? I think one of the teams is going to win, and the other one isn't. That is incredible. That's it. We, we can just leave. We've done our job. Bye. Excellent. Remember, yes. donate. Bye. I'm out. Sleep squad should be in a strong position here. Um, the uh, sniper is foregoing the uh, huntsman. Uh, at least old talk yet. I haven't seen Neon yet. Oh yeah, no, they're on a uh, regular uh, rifle as well. Uh, Kurt's getting rolled out here, although Peter's Scraps continues the tradition from last map of unnecessary deaths. Uh, Versity does get a nice backstab <laughs> on the medic, but uh, Peter Scraps, that's not really a, a good situation to lose your medic. Yeah, it's sort of unusual. I mean, normally we see sort of a, a wave of people kind of flocking onto or flocking out of the uh, spawn in order to just kind of uh, maybe enact the death of the the, uh, the defensive team. Uh, Peter Scraps decided to forego that motion and, and go full out himself, uh, but did not manage to get away. So unusual death there. Uh, but uh, nonetheless, they managed to get the cart quite a long way forward uh, before they have to worry about it. And Peter Scraps is back in action. So uh, hopefully you're going to see another Uber out of him any moment soon. Uh, but in the meantime, I'm, I'm seeing a bit of spy action from behind coming from Potacto. Uh, maybe he's going to pull some damage, less dangerous thing onto uh, onto Peter if you can find him. Peter Scraps did just die to a rocket right about now, so... Uh, unfortunate there, so uh, no no juicy, juicy med kill for him. And in fact, uh, he dies to a pyro as well anyway. Sergeant Pinecone uh, is pushing this cart, pushing a little cart forward and takes first point on his own without any other team member helping out in any conceivable way. Yeah, that was actually a really phenomenal uh, solo cap from him. Uh, Ost has picked up two kills in this uh, retreating process, but yeah, if he hadn't gotten that cap there, then uh, the defense might have continued quite a bit longer. I agree. And uh, right now, yeah, they're 
Push continues. Things kind of slow down for a second here on upward. But blue team is getting control of the hill pretty easily. The sentry gun kind of on the back side of the corner. Some teams do like to set it up if they can at the mouth of the cave. Not going to happen this time. Peter Scraps falls down to the side here by the cliff edge. Uh, Lazy Purple's there. And a one-on-one -on -one versus Mort just guns him down. Peter Scraps is going to be in trouble. But uh, can Lazy Purple actually finish off the kill? I don't know. It's going to be Proctato rotating in with that revolver. He gets the finish. Zulu Man is there as well. So even though Lazy Purple goes down, the frag's still coming out for Red Team. But once again, the heavy weapons guy pushing the cart. Yeah, Sergeant Panko seems to be a powerhouse all onto himself. I was going to say, can nobody stop him? But it looks like uh, Zulu Man can stop him. Uh, so that was uh, an unfortunate uh, moment of time there. Uh, I I'm wondering whether the entire blue team is going to be waiting for Peter Scraps before they make their next move, or are they going to try and start squim uh, squimming in on their own? Peter Scraps out front with Pyro, with Chloe Mew, uh, the uh, protagonist who owns the uh, namesake of this team. We are, I think they're waiting for an Uber to build up so they can make a move. Yeah, I mean, that's a smart play here. They're just kind of towing the cart forward a little bit. If first that he can get a snap, a uh, snap on the gun, um, that could certainly help open things up here. But otherwise, they're just getting into um, apartments. Sir Doc keeping a, a teleporter up nearby and have the uh, sentry. Snap coming Versity. out on the medic though, though, which is a very nice pick off. But uh, he's got his eyes into a rocket. So both medics yeah, and both teams. Yeah, Zulu man and uh, other players combining to get a lot of pressure on blue team. Nian's still sniping from the back, but most of the offensive pressure has been stopped. I've just seen the placement of the uh, the red team's exit. Uh, it's out there on the sort of sniper deck, so it's a nice little placement to, to try and get the players out and into the action. Um, I'm I'm wondering now what the next move is going to be. Is, is it going to be a, a, a build to an Uber, or are they going to push in on their own? What can any of these classes really do against this solid defense? Benny was trying to peek the sentry up the window, but he gets sent not he, not, he gets knocked back all the way. Barely manages to live on three health. I think uh, that's a, a real tell when uh, you get knocked all the way back to to three health. That's yeah, like slapping like punch into tomorrow. Wow. Okay. So I want to see uh, Bendy. Uh, I mean, having been on such incredibly low health, uh, knocks a few rockets uh, into the distant future, uh, and is now a, a worthy uh, winner of the Uber of the Year. Uh, as he pushes his way into the red team. They are now completely on the back foot. Everything has turned around for them. Uh, all of these morts throwing out a thousand stickies uh, and, and getting uh, just as many kills, almost possibly. Probably not, but because uh, he's only played nine players on the team. A thousand kills in a, in a Highlander. That, I mean, that's, that, that's worthy. That, that, that's surely a team wipe almost. Uh, yeah. Just a, a, a quick uh, a, a thing in shirts. No, Benny is not Banny. Um, they are. They, they have been seen together in the same place at the same time. No matter what you might be thinking. Speaking yeah, we just going up for CGI. I'm afraid. He's managed to get behind their whole team, and they've not seen him. He's gone. He's just shooting. We'll tack it out. He manages, and he dies. At least he got a kill. I was looking at yeah, Pierce Scott's point, point of view there. From him. I was looking at uh, Pierre Scott's point of view there. He would have saw the spy at the corner of his eye there on screen, but I don't think he'd noticed. There's a little bit of tunnel vision there. Big, uh, big protection play by Sir Duck there. Soldier was coming in from behind, although Mort just falls to his death off the cliff. <laughs> Whoops. Whoops. It looks like Blue Team is making really good pressure here and will be able to get the capture on third. So that uh, defense can drag on sometimes, but uh, in this case, uh, we're able to uh, break it open really quickly. I saw Peter Scraps doing something quite unusual there for a medic. He was doing like the, the pyro or uh, the, uh, the demo equivalent of uh, raising a skirt and uh, he was actually stood in front of the cart, having it put him up the front of the hill. Uh, so that's, uh, that's a real sarcastic movement. So it's like, uh, come and get me if you can. Uh, and the Uber has been popped, uh, speaking of coming to get me, in, in a slightly peculiar place. Uh, I think that was a, a save my ass kind of uh, uh, an Uber rather than a we're coming to get you. Yeah, he was yeah. taking quite a bit of damage there, so he had to pop and not drop at that time. I think he learned his lesson from last match. Uh, however, the cart is getting cleared somewhat. Yeah, Sergeant Pinecone could have uh, taken that opportunity to push the cart a little bit. He's trying to head down low, though, to uh, get that health pack uh, at the bottom of Staircase. Now, Sturch, 
Snutch finding the unfortunate soul of, uh, of that uh, spy. Uh, Versity is... Oh, no! No, tell a lie! Uh, Versity uh, takes uh, takes the brain skull of uh, Ulst uh, for his trophy wall once again. Red was at a decent Uber in Carnage, but now nah, that's all gone. It's considering gone. how considering how well they were doing it in the last map it seems like this complete role reversal for them upward is definitely uh, a map that this uh, this sombrero induced team is uh, is happy to be wielding i mean yeah, uh, I Koth, never them. Koth is a real challenging uh, map for sure and um, definitely sometimes it's just a, a play style that people can't really get their uh, gameplay around but uh, payload completely different, which also, you know, conversely, some people have problems with. Right now, though, um, things coming together really well for blue team. This Ubercharge um, is uh, pretty decent as well. They're going to have to fix or deal with that some little two-century gun, but they are uh, just getting bodies on the cart. Not enough bodies, though. Oh, my oh, goodness oh. me! Did you see that? Oh, am I going blind? Was that a, a flip? I, a flip I, of the carts? I, I saw it. I had flashbacks to the ghost cart, though. I don't know if you guys are aware of my previous trauma on this map. Uh, yeah, it was uh, a, a famous video from uh, Sin um, highlighting the Portland Burnsiders getting screwed out of an upward match when the cart exploded when it uh, did not go over. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> it did not go over, and it exploded. Oh. It was sad. Oh. Welcome to the weirdness that is Team Fortress 2. Yeah, if you haven't seen yeah, this game yeah. before, that there's plenty more weirdness to come. But yeah, a cart flip is a good indication of things uh, not quite going the way that the team wants to uh, wants to make them go. Uh, and speaking of, Peter Scraps gets a shot to the brain skull uh, and goes down for his trouble. So that is the end of that particular push. They've done so well to get the cart to this position, and it looks like it looks like the red team has remembered where they are and what they're doing, and is going back out with a vengeance. Versity is not going to take this lying down though, uh, although he has to because he's dead. <laughs> yeah, this this last point defense has been coming together though. So I mean, you guys have been hyping up this blue team, but uh, they they need to get that cart over the uh, edge. And right now it's just rolling backwards. It's one thing that happens when you're pushing in in this particular way. When you when you've got that momentum going, uh, and everything seems to be going your way, and then and then it stops, and you're you have to you have to add a team, uh, kind of move together. Uh, without coincidence, with actual meaning, with with desire, uh, and and with the the ability to play as a team, uh, mm -hmm. this is going to be like I think the proven point for this team. Can they figure out how to move together as one? And now we're going to see whether or not that is possible. The engineer earlier, the engineer went back to spawn, but basically was sapping the sentry. But the engineer couldn't get past his own defensive barricade, and the sentry just slowly died. Well, Benny manages to get the kill on that player, but uh, Proctato comes back in, kills Peter Scraps, possibly for the last time this round, with Sergeant Pinecone doing the final push <laughs> in. The entirety of team is on map, and there it goes. They finally uh... managed to capture this point. Uh, the, the round is... Uh, the timer has been set uh, for this round, and is, is that a good time? Solo, like, do you, you want to like uh, weigh in on this one? Uh, from Three points I've heard six vaguely, minutes. And I'm not sure if ten minutes is a good time. But... Yeah, I, I I'm gonna go on the no the no camp. <laughs> like if <laughs> if they had, if they'd shaved like that last minute and a half, and you got like nine minutes, and you'd be like, yeah, that was that was pretty good. Like they're gonna build some confidence off that. But like just having everything shut down at the end there, that makes it real rough. That just gives um, our team now wearing blue the the sleep squad on the offense. They just have so much time to work with. I mean, um, even if they get slowed down on the second point or the third point, they're still going to roll into last with several minutes to work with. Um, so, you know, it can still happen, but it, it's a little bit on the slower side. But don't forget, these teams, both of these teams, are not competitive teams. They, they have a bunch of players, a bunch of YouTubers and, and streamers and uh, fun boys having a great time, and girls. Um, and, and everything else in between. Uh, th th this, as, as a bunch of randos, 10 minutes, not bad. I think both teams are going to have trouble with last in particular. Well, uh, I think that the red team is going to be hoping the blue team is going to be having a bit of trouble on Lost, uh, watching uh, Nyan and oh. Zach here, uh, seeing if he can get a couple of uh, good kills off. 
Yeah, Versity tries to cloak and dagger on the uh, Zion post there, which is a neat little hiding spot, but did get called out uh, by Zulu Man and the uh, scout. Zulu Man running that direct hit, uh, but does get sniped down by Nyan. And Sergeant Pinecone, maybe a little bit far forward here. Um, Peter Scraps, you know, on offense on this map, if you're uh, the medic, you go down a couple times, ah, no big deal. But um, on defense, it's going to be really important that he doesn't get dropped in crazy circumstances. I think we might be seeing it, but yep, there it is right now. Uh, Peter Scraps pushing out, to trying to do as much damage with Sergeant Pinecone. Sergeant Pinecone has been instrumental in just doing amazing amounts of damage at this point. Although he is on the defensive right now. Peter Scraps, get out of there, get out of there, boy. Yeah, and uh, I really like that Uber Charge, actually. That's kind of uh, uncommon, you know, to see uh, players push that far forward. Um, wow, Nyan on a really interesting spot as well, getting the snipe on Grandpa. I actually haven't seen that uh, defensive sniper hiding spot. Really tight angle. Um, uh, but Zulu Man pushing forward, having to deal with Sir Duck here, and uh, Nyan has been alerted, has the uh, Bushwhacker out, but Zulu Man full health. They're actually melee fight in the back lines, but Zulu Man will take it. And uh, this defense starting to uh, crumble here. Zulu Man still lurking behind. He picks a health pack up. We'll be uh, trying to come up from tunnels here. I don't think they're willing to, to let this point go quite so easily. I'm seeing Chloe Mew out there uh, doing a bit of damage and destruction, although the point has gone. Uh, uh, now the realistic thing, that the thing they've got to be doing now is deciding, are they going to try and defend Hill? Are they going to try and put up any serious kind of uh, uh, defensive to tactic, or are they going to try and pull back and, and hold a place that they know they can hold? I think if uh, if history has anything to go by, then uh, we're going to see everybody pushing hard and fast mm. all the way forward. And Peter and, Scratch uh, just Peter dropped Scratch again. <laughs> Peter Scratch just dropped Uber. What yep. was that about history, Agro? <laughs> yeah, I think uh, I think we all know what the MO for Peter Scraps is right now, and let's get out there and Poor try guy. and do uh, <laughs> try and throw your eyeballs in in the general bullet direction. Betty's a meme, so I fell down. There's a really funny spot above the uh, windows you can stand on. Ooh, nice snipe by Nyan. I'm getting Zulu, man. That'll slow the cart push down just a little bit. Uh, Oltaki pushing far, pretty far forward. Melee into Nyan there. Yeah, Nyan is doing insane amounts of damage right now. That's a that's a a, a sniper with a lot on their mind. Oh. Speaking a lot on their mind, Versity uh, does an amazing shooting action against that uh, that life that lifeless soul uh, that's uh, currently lying in the dirt right now. Talking, of course, of Oust. But uh, uh, Sentry's still up, which is a major cornerstone on the defense here. Circuit also getting backstabbed as he was getting in position to maybe push the cart. Lazy Purple actually getting a lot of distance for free there. Sergeant Pinecone will pop uh, pop in there to uh, put a stop to it. But uh, Zulu Man also trying to play footsies with the cart here to get this done. The Uber Charge popped to save Sergeant Pinecone. A, a direct hit soldier in his face. Mort might be able to parlay off this. See if he can uh, splash frog um, off the ropes and get in there. But he's going to stand back and uh, just splash a little bit more damage out there. Yeah, that, that was a good uh, good decision. Um, I mean, they <laughs> just <laughs> bye purple. Oh, uh, lazy purple scooted off the edge there. Launched so off duck, by uh, the sentry. Mm. So duck takes that. So I think that's going to go on a sir duck uh, reel there. We uh, that was kind of cute. We take those. Yeah, boy. Yeah, this is good defense here, though. Dragging out this um, second point, you know. Just as long as you can, slows down the spawns, um, slows down just the, the cart movement, which is what it's all about. Peter Scraps is like, I'm going to stand on the cart. That is some risky behavior for your medic. Benny's going to get out there now, but Peter Scraps, yeah, he's just got his back to proc potato. Oh, Who gets no. the stab? Oh, Was that a full drop? I don't know if he had yet, but just, just careless behavior. Although having said that, oh, gets oh, oh, oh. Gets the and uh, Pyro pushes the circuit off the cliff. Hilarious stuff there. Lazy Purple finally trying to get this capture, and Red actually does stop it one more time here. Zulu Man bombing in. He gets taken out. The Sentry Gun still doing work. This capture is taking forever. Yeah, Sergeant Pinecone, I can see out of the vicinity of his eyeballs, there was, he was crouched down and, and a sticky just landed at his feet. They had no chance to get away from that one. But yeah, that's uh, I, that was a very solid defense. Uh, they managed to hold out that point for as long as humanly possible. And I think they've done a good uh, a good task of running the time down, running the clock down. You said before, uh, I think UX time was saying that they, uh, if they get those first two, if they even like leave out a little extra time on those, those first two points. Uh, there'll still be plenty to play for, but I, I, I'm not sure that 
that was a little bit longer than I was expecting them to uh, to hold out for. Yeah, so now that they have that capture, though, the uh, spawn points push backwards. Blue team will get a little bit of a respite here and um, get uh, uh, their force together to push in a third. Peter did get caught out earlier, so what that means is that Blue's going to have about a 70% add right now. Yeah, I'm looking at those uh, numbers they didn't seem to be checking out. So, right. Um, what are we, we going to do? Congratulations, no, I've not been practicing. Oh, oh 80 yeah. Yeah. Solar Light's been wasting his time with all the trimping action. I've been practicing numbers. It was Solar Light I was talking to. You're just reading what he said. You uh, don't even enough. try and take that credit. <laughs> oh, well, in that case, not only has been using the, the number thing, but he's also been doing the demo man thing, and, and I'm just wasting my time right now. So I'm also, first thing my Max that, by the way, uh, against Heavy. Missed the Medic, however. Versus is coming up on cart. What's he going to do? Get shot in the face. And Sergeant Pineco, nothing GG. down here though. Oh, it doesn't stop it uh, right before the ramps. So Those ramps are pretty key. But uh, then again, you know, if they can just control for a bit, get it rolling backwards, they're still quite close here. Yeah, I'm not seeing a, a blue clutch, a, a blue team moving forward to try and take back that point. Uh, but I, but the way we've seen this play out in the past, Peter Scott has done this thing where he, he rolls all the way forwards and doesn't use his Uber, but he has done right now his Uber Benny. Uh, and Benny uh, is, away. is, yeah, I mean, they're, they're, they're doing the right thing. They're running away. They're, they're kind of uh, retreating back to a safe place. Uh, but he just it kind is... of stuck on the cart there right now. I mean, I... I'm not sure if he should be there. He needs to get back to his team. I, I think he's in a place where nobody expects him to be, oh, and maybe that's the defense. Oh, oh, oh Peter Scraps. <laughs> I'm glad no one saw that, uh, Peter Scraps. You totally got away with that. Uh, nobody saw you fall down the hole. That was absolutely perfect. Uh, I mean... Man, I wish I did. This defense has been surprisingly strong, but Lazy Purple, nice kill on Yan. Has to push this card up the ramp, though, single-handedly, which can be uh, tricky. Benny's going to run into a Happy Purple on the side. They're going to trade Crag, so... Lazy Purple with uh, Austin Ritchie um, are going to be able to get cart up the first ramp. Should be able to get up the second one as well. We'll see if Mort can maybe get some uh, pressure up there. Mort tried to jump in, deny the card the last second. That did not work. Paid for it with his life. Which is much worse he almost jumped right into the pit. But he died anyway. Yeah, that's like two people easy, on red. That's just, easy uh, push. A couple minutes left here, you know, and like I said, it might just be all they need. There has been good defense so far, but the uh, level two sentry gun, uh, Sir Duck just hitting it with that ramp, just trying to level it up. About two minutes ago, just under it. And oh I'll probably be able to get this happy, last point. Happy Purple took out Peter Scratch, took out all of the, the, the defensive force uh, with one good hill. Uh, and this, this could be it. This is the push that they've been waiting for. It's uh, less than two minutes left on the clock. Uh, what can they do? Can they make this uh, exciting thing happen? Yeah, I, mean, I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. <laughs> I didn't have that. <laughs> uh, <laughs> that was a rhetorical question or not, but I guess I got my answer. I wasn't sure if it was rhetorical. And uh, Lazy Purple and us, I mean, pushing from below here, this is pretty smart stuff, but it's all about controlling tiles. And uh, Chloe Mew gets a reflect kill on Zulu Mew here. Sergeant Pineco is actually going to rotate down low here. I like the aggressiveness the of this play, but they don't have an Uber charge on defense. That was way too aggressive. They're going to be in trouble now. The cart no longer rolling backwards. It's rolling forward. Minute left on the clock. Mork gets gunned down by Proctato. Uh, the sentry gun is still up, though. And uh, what will win the one level three sentry gun or one cart? 45 seconds left on the clock. This. Lazy Purple jumping over to try to gun down uh, Peter Scrap. has got a lot of players around him, but Peter Scrap's so low, get pistol down. There's no push on the cart right now. Sergeant Pinecone, Pyro Joe backed up by Mort. Happy, Pur uh, Happy Purple upstairs, Zulu Man upstairs. They don't have teammates working with them. Yeah, Sergeant Zulu Man keeps trying to build up Sentry Gun. It keeps getting taken out by Zulu oh, Man in the oh! distance there. Proctato with a huge backstab. And oh, the go with so the go! Uh, lazy so purple close. there as well. No! Oh, 10 seconds left on the clock. Somebody's just right now. They don't have a choice. 
but yeah, they're still I think slow. They, they, they didn't get to oh, the time. Oh, oh, they're too slow. Oh, they're way, way too slow. slow. Oh. Probably not realizing that there's no overtime on this. <sighs> yeah, it's yeah. casual, you get overtime, but competitive, you do not. Which is ultimately going to turn that one around. I mean, Stop. it's it's stopwatch, you know. So there's a, a fixed uh, target that they got to reach. We're not able to do so, and uh, sort of surprisingly, shining Saberos outshining the sleep squad. Uh, is it, it is it so, uh, too late for me to take back the thing that I said that this team was going to win on? Because that was nope. not no. Okay, All you right, have fine, a chance. Fair come enough. come over to the sleep side. No, not no. the sleep side. The shine side. Come on. Come on. You know you want to. Do you know... <laughs> that was good. They, I mean, they... Uh, genuinely, I thought that they really had it. I thought that they were... They were kind of like fluffing themselves. Just going, oh yeah, we've got this. We've got this. Let's let's give them a chance. Let's, 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 let's destroy them in the final seconds. But they just left it too late. There was not enough in the tank and they could not follow through. They they weren't able to, to capture the car in, in the time allocated to them and they just lost that point. Um, uh, super unfortunate. Yeah, definitely. Uh, we'll need to double check. I think we're going to video, but just before, I, th I thought originally we were doing uh, best of three payload, but it looks like we might be switching over to warm tick instead. Yeah, we're just switching over to warm tick. I'm being confirmed. So we're going to switch over to a video showcasing special effect who we are doing this wonderful effect, wonderful effect for a uh, wonderful <laughs> event for. My words are all mangling into one. Uh, you know what I mean. And please enjoy the video. It gives you some good info about what these wonderful people are doing. Every donation helps. Every word of mouth spreading that word helps. Watch the video. Information. Important. See you in a bit. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Bite My Asky. I'm joined by a few lovely people by the names of Agro. Hello. Eckstein. Yow. And Solar Light. All Demo Night TSU. There we are. He said it for us. It's all good. Uh, I just want to quickly start off by saying we are almost at our last incentive. We have what we may have reached the main goal of 1500 but there is one last incentive of $2,250. It is a time of giving. Uh, the incentive would have an additional 12-hour stream next weekend to bring the event to a close. They don't think the donation link closes until the start of January. So that's going to be open until then. Uh, please do consider giving. It is for a very good cause that is special effect. They help those less fortunate than ourselves be able to play video games, which connects the world, connects people to their own families, to friends. It's a really important thing that people don't realize and take for granted. Uh, if you can't donate, please do spread the word as well, of course. The more gamers, the merrier. Uh, it is a time for sharing. Not just giving. We are having wonderful entertainment here. These amazing players are going through thick and thin, going back and forth, holding one point. Uh, we are currently on warm tick as well. So constantly more content coming out. All for this one event. For you guys. We're bringing it all to you. So please do feel the, the charitable spirit within you and try to donate if you care. Absolutely. Uh, Solar Light, I want to ask you, uh, presumably you, you have some uh, skills when it comes to Warm Tick. Uh, this is a map you've seen before. Um, how, how, do, how do you play Warm Tick? How do you play Warm Tick? Are we talking about like Demo Knight or in general? Uh, I, whatever your skill base can cover. I'm assuming Demo Knight particularly. So Demo Knight. <laughs> Admittedly, I don't play this map very much, so it's hard for me to really say. You can try though, surely. Mm. For the kids. Come on. Mm. Come on. For the gamers. I, I know the ladder leading up to the house looks like a really good jump spot for one. I can see myself just flying behind the entire team every I time can, I get roll out. I can see the little ladder leading up to the house does work as a trim spot. I've done it myself a couple times. Excellent. Uh, x time have you got any more insight than the, than the little ladder? Yeah, I've, I've played this map a few times. Um, and I mean, it's, it's interesting. It's basically kind of like product, but... Um, the high ground's a little bit closer, the uh, point a little bit more elevated, and uh, there's kind of the, the banana on the side, the uh, little kind of side tunnel. So really kind of controlling that upper level and containers 
um, is is super important. Watch for players on the high ground. This map definitely kind of has, has a element of a verticality to it. There's a, also there's the uh, tunnel underneath, so you get like engineers or pyros occasionally making real aggressive plays. Um, there's a lot of opportunities for spies to get in behind. Uh, it's, it's a very open map, um, but also you know some close engagements. The sniper lines are not so crazy. To clarify, banana describes the shape of a tunnel as opposed to yeah. there being an actual banana. Yeah, it's not taped to the wall or anything. It's that is just a the shape of the tunnel. So, there's, there's no tape to the wall banana getting sold for like 10 grand like there was uh, the other day, no? I do I not believe so, but you know, Team Fortress is a, is a form of performance art, right? Uh, I'd yeah, like to think definitely. so. Yeah, we'll see that. We'll, we'll, we'll go with that. But uh, yeah, I like this map a lot. I think it's real cool. Um, but you know, again, we did see a pretty uh, dominant uh, performance from the Sleep Squad on Koth product. So my instinct would that we would be actually see a similar performance on this map, even if um, pl players are similarly inexperienced on it. Yeah, that's so, a very good judgment to go by, uh, considering like Koth was seeming to be their niche, if you will, compared to Team Sorero. So uh, we're not sure when we're going to ready up. I think everyone's having a little toilet break just now. So we're going to we're going to continue talking just now. So uh, how are you guys doing? Hi. Hi. Hey. See, see any good How's films? Ah, uh, not really. No. No. See. Nah. Uh, what's um? Oh, well, we've had the ice cream conversation. I think we've oh, had I the have. chili conversation as well. Mm, yeah. Um. If if you weren't making chilies right now, what would you? Uh, what what would your outlet be? Uh. Mm. uh Excellent. Um, what do you mean? <laughs> like, like your your creative, your professional outlet, your your thing to kind of like uh, wind down. How 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 does an X time exist in the world? Uh, I like Ken Ken puzzles. I like reading history. You know, history books are cool. It sounds good. What's a Ken Ken puzzle? Uh, it's like, like Sudoku, can -can. but have... it's cool. It's cooler. So like, you got like a Sudoku grid. Yeah. But then you also have kind of like almost Tetris shape pieces like drawn out on it and right. then those pieces will have like a four plus and so like if a four plus is like three squares and an l then that's going to be like one two one like arranged in a sudoku so it like follows the rules of sudoku but then it'll like give you a mathematical thing of like two uh divisible sign and so then it's like the numbers that are in there divide into two for a man who describes um, so perfectly Team Fortress 2 to anyone <laughs> and everyone, I am I am significantly less aware of what this puzzle thing is now that you've yeah, described it to a me. A visual assistant before. would help. Yeah, a visual absolutely. assistant. But it's it's oh, basically oh, Sudoku oh, plus math. It's oh, like crosswords mixed with Sudoku. It's, it's, it's pretty awesome. It's pretty awesome. Cut off this wonderful conversation because it looks like we are starting. Puzzle uh, time is over. It's yeah, back but, into the acting. Uh, get out of here, nerds. This is for the gamers. Yeah, and uh, engineers will play a uh, significant role in this map as well. Surdoc did a good job um, on that um, first map of Product, but uh, we'll see if Grandpa can kind of get a little bit more um, engaged with his setup. Uh, right now, Pyro Joe and Mort going down more to backstab, but his roller does kill Proctato. Big bomb in from Benny Ost in trouble, oh, able to survive. Oh no, not forever though, as Benny also gets the Pyro with the same rocket. A lot of blue players going down, though. Uh, Benny managed to get us, and that's uh, that's all that we count. Uh, that uh, blue team down to just three players right now. Uh, Zulu man out on his own, trying to do, uh, trying to stand up for his squad. Uh, looks like this uh, this this team, this this ragtag group of individuals, uh, the, uh, the 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 sleepiness of sombreros, uh, seem to be in the controlling position right now. They've got their foot on the clock. Uh, and the timer is ticking down here for them and them exclusively. He discussed with Red big uber advantage as well, so... It's his to lose. <laughs> yeah. Oh, and, he does uh, pop. Nervous uh, pills coming by, but yeah, it does use the uber charge. Zulu man uh, jumping over the top, actually trades with Nyan, getting uh, sniped down at the same time he fires a final rocket. And Peter Scraps will be able to back up post Uber Charge. Sergeant Pinecone in some trouble, though. The first arrow heal attempt from Peter Scraps didn't land. I think that one does, though. Could that use one, one more. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> it, 
Uh, Benny Odd Wall jumps there, uh, but at the same time, Sir Duck with the wraparound gets the the uh, fist kill on Ultaki. So uh, Red Team uh, has a pretty good hold on this point, and so uh, continue to lock it down. This other man getting sniped by Nyan. And there's just not much pressure from that uh, banana uh, from the blue team. I mean, that's just a really good way to get a little bit of crossfire going on on the point. Um, nice Jurati thrown in there. Does get the heavy weapons guy and the medic. Heavy weapons will um, burn down. As, uh, well, Lazy Purple actually got the finish there. And there goes Peter Scraps, though. The uh, snipe from Oltaki. Back, uh, back to the Uber Charge on Lazy Purple. Chloe... She's trying to um, do some work with Pyro there. Lazy Purple kind of chasing her back into the tunnel. And Zulu Man killing um, Pyro Joe there. The blue team will be able to take the point here. There'll be three people up for red, and that's going to be an easy cap for blue, definitely. Yeah, Grandpa has the opportunity to build as well. So that looks like they're, they're building not only their, uh, their hold, but their defense as well. Yeah, so blue looks like they're going to stick around on point with Ulta. Getting sniped there by Nyan. Uh, I'm not sure where he got that from. Just from the right side, maybe? Left side? Yeah, the, the, he's, he's at the right side of the map right now. Ah, that was, right, that was such a good snipe that I'm looking at Nyan's profile right now to see whether or not they are level 3 Steam accounts uh, and if they have any friends. <laughs> and uh, yeah, the game's any, accounts any there. Topic, yeah, a little question mark is appearing right, above his name. Profile. That's the one. Nyan, uh, you've earned oh, the respect. Yeah, Hands on the right hand side, getting down the sight lane. Body shot and he'll attack it again. Uh, medic knows he's there. Ghost trying to stay out of sight. A little bit of a fight happening. Spy behind Peter Scraps, not getting the oh. back tackle. Oh, the yeah, medic goes was... down! The medic's down, yeah. he dropped. I believe he got heard the sound of a drop Uber. Yeah, that was Versity with the stab there. Oh, that was beautiful. Mm -hmm. What sound is a, a dropped Uber make? Is it sort of a, a, a cow moo or is it some sort of. Uh, uh, it's more like a staticky shock sort of thing. These are people running at Peter Scraps from behind. He does get the kill. Ah, Peter Scraps goes down. Ooh, That's. Uh, Zulu Man losing focus on the point there, turning his back on Benny without realizing he's there. Benny cleaning up, helping my team capture the point now. Uh, Proctato is sneaking around. What's he going to do? He's at the point, he drops down. He's sneaking behind towards Red Side. And my whispering indicates that he is, in fact, sneaking. But, uh, I can see, can see him in the peripheral of my vision. I know he's there. And they know he's about. He's uncloaked. People are creeping towards him. Scout suspicious. He's been found. Pyro Joe has saw him. Proteo still kills more, though. Wow. How yeah, is this? Still getting bags out despite yeah. the situation. That's the mark of a good spy. They're always getting at least one kill in trade, no matter uh, if things are pretty bad for him. So the man in a good location to maybe bomb down on um, the uh, combo, but there's a pyro down there offering protection. He's Gets also the dispenser. Uh, you know. Yeah. He's just gonna stay up there. Yeah, Parkato bombs the, uh, the uh, scout. Yeah, it does get that telly. Ubercharge pop kind of early, but it is lazy purple, so on the scout we'll be able to run forward. And also, they do just need to get some uh, capture time going here. Um, Proctato uh, finds Mort hiding in that uh, apartments area. Um, handguns him down. Waiting, yeah, uh, handguns him down. A little bit of a, a lover's tiff there. They were very in each other's face, and Mort was just shooting grenades everywhere. Yeah, yeah Lazy Purple yeah. behind it, uh, putting some pressure on Peter Scraps, but um, not oh, quite able to get the kill the or the pop. Like, Eight well. health. Yeah, and then the engineer steals that health pack that's uh, right on the other side of the ramp there. Uh, Old Taki sniping that way as well. Gets Chloe Mew, but uh, Sandwich coming out, so now Peter Scraps nice and healthy. They want to use this Uber Charge to get out there and uh, get a retake, which would end this round. Red Team does seem to be warming out uh, throughout this uh, uh, match. Uh, oh, it's in some trouble here. In banana now, but Pyro Joe with the flank gonna see him over there. Proctato's there. A lazy purple walking in Pyro yeah, like, Joe's head and running towards the yeah. <laughs> And Red takes the win, shining at some railroads, getting that first point there. Delicious. Yeah. Yummy. Very strong performance from them. Um, you know, they definitely seem to have a, a bit better of a grasp of Warm Tick. Um, definitely, yeah. Versus the uh, Sleep Squad. Significant improvement over uh, the first map, which was Viaduct, I think. Uh, yeah, but, Product. Oh, uh, Product. That was a professional Viaduct. 
Yeah, Peter Scrap's doing a good job of kind of towing around, making sure to dodge most of that damage that's coming in. And um, some of the players from Blue uh, getting cleaned up here. Oltaki and Pro, uh, Proctato, excuse me. Zulu Man also not really finding his way in past enemy lines. As the point uh, opens up, Circuit just staying there alone. Neon in a crazy position uh, with that Huntsman. And uh, Red going to be able to take over the point here. Red are still holding it pretty well. Got Happy Purple going in the right tunnel there, fighting off Nyan. He's going to be able to do it. He's pulling back. Zulu following up, finishing off Nyan. Got a few more rockets in there, damaging Chloe Mew, Benny, and Peter Scraps all clumped together, getting one rocket to damage them all. And Chloe Mew getting finished off with Zulu Man bombing over. Blue have control of the point. Yeah, Peter Scraps in the shack. We'll use the Uber Charge on Benny, but Benny getting reflected back, so they're just really not going to get anything effectively done with this nice um, charge. Nice game pong, if you will. Yeah, and he's following he's his... running at the point of the spy. I'm yeah, sure. that was questionable. He's, kind of, he's still kind of in the tunnel, just underneath, hanging about. I'm not sure if they... Yeah, they don't think they know that he's there, though. Benny um, misses the whip, and then he jumps crates, but other players are there to escort the medic. Um, Benny taking a lot of damage though from the heavy weapons guy. Follow up from Zulu Man, that's an easy kill. And uh, Jirati on Zulu Man though, so he's gonna be an easy kill for oh, somebody else. Actually, gonna be a bad falls out of the good. sky that nice. lands yeah. on him. That was nice. Yan gets a headshot on Happy Purple as well. Uh, Blue team are going in the, the right hand tunnel once again while it captures. Uh, circuit at the back, getting some pot shots of his mini. Old tech. Oh, oh Versi gets another backstab in the uh, background there. Very nice. Yeah, Ubercharge comes out here, and uh, Ost actually getting completely Ooh, separated from Lazy blocking. Purple. Lazy Purple is going to try to come in here to protect. Yeah, good for well, It doesn't seem to be Girl. enough. Red is dropping the close. More just power bombing from behind. Gets three players in the nice spree. Does look like a blue see, uh, team, though. Might be able to get this captured nonetheless. I can see a sneaky Proctato on the red side. As well as Lazy Purple, both in the, the left hut for Red. Potato is behind Sir Duck. Lazy Purple taking out Sir Duck before he can make a move or build anything. I mean, that's helpful. You know, if he'd gotten that teleporter down, um, that would have been beneficial for himself the next time he spawns oh, up. Oh, Potato's getting healed by yeah. Peter. He unclones in front of Peter, and Peter's just healing him. Yeah, that doesn't get just... anything out of it, but that was, um, that was a little lapse of perception there. A little bit unfortunate, but uh, not enough to change the game. No, definitely not. Potato didn't manage to uh, gain anything from that. A little bit of a tussle happening on point. Red team are starting to get a foothold on it. Uh, a little mini sentry wrecking a bit of havoc. Taking out Benny. Chloe Mew cowering behind the containers. I'm not sure it's called cowering when you're dead. Uh, Chloe Mew's still alive. That is a huge drone. It just hit five people. Yeah, that the big helps take out that heavy weapons guy. A grandpa on the side as well. Just needs a little bit of damage, but is actually able to stay alive before anything comes at him. Peter Scraps surfed across the map, disconnected from his teammates. Didn't matter too much. Able to get back there to work with more. Mer also getting um, a kill there, but hey, as Uber Charge fades. Yeah, there he goes. Yeah, no way of defending against that Uber, I'm afraid. There's just expired. Mort is now behind. He's just he's just going all guns to the wall. He takes out Zulu, man. Is he able to take out anyone else? Will he take out Grandpa? He's low. He does. White Most. goes down, Versity gets a backstab, however, on a circuit. Benny finishing off Happy Purple, and Versity taking down the teleporter for a blue team. Yeah, that was got, at the moment. yeah I got a saw there at the end of that uh, last engagement. Has to be a little bit careful here. This is definitely where in Koth maps that, uh, you know, as a medic, you want to survive, you want to heal your players, but uh, if there's not that many players up, you just can't really hang out. You're going to have to, like, back up and make sure that you can stay safe. Definitely, the medic is relying on his, on his teammates just as they are relying on him. Uh, it's, it's kind of something I said a few times in the past, but uh, there's absolutely no way to build an Uber if you're out on your own. Yep, that's wise and right. right there. But there's a little bit of a tussle happening. Proctato gets a back up on Yan, Lazy oh. Purple, they're going to pint going while Pyro takes out Lazy Purple. Yeah, Pyro oh, has a nice meat more, shot nearly there. going down to a random arrow there. He was very low. I think he was on one HP. Oh, my there goodness is a blue me. Uber. Blue Uber. Blue Uber super Blue effective Uber. as well. Takes down Peter Scraps uh, and is pushing in. They're hungry. They want more. They want to take as much as they possibly can for this Uber. Pine in. It's not happening. Pine, Pine going not really playing it smart there. But he's going balls to the wall right there. 
Absolutely. No Going like one versus six. It doesn't go well. Unsurprisingly. This guy's lazy. Lazy uh, purple. Just need to hit one melee. Oh. Lazy purple. I was trying to get lazy fish. to hit him one time. Fish kill. It's going to be the nice. kill of the season. That that is beautiful. That is absolutely wonderful. If you're going to take a, a fish to the face, uh, make sure you do it against Peter Scratch. Uh, notorious. Yeah, notorious uh, fish eater. Um, <laughs> yeah, Lazy Purple says highlight of my life. And definitely a, a good round there from the Sleep Squad. Starting to figure this map out a little bit okay. more. Um, Mort was doing a lot of damage from just kind of oh, walking yeah. on, underneath and um, kind of turning around and getting a lot of damage out there. Um, there's a lot of spots that you got to watch out for this in, on this map. Yeah, definitely, especially with a well placed spy or a well placed sniper mm. with the right sight line. Anyone's head is game for sniper, I feel. If they get from, you can actually see uh, just on the right hand side of the hut, you can see right along to their side. That's I find that that's been pretty dangerous for myself, in my experience at least. Uh, and Isaac gets uh, a bit of pee on the players, but uh, not able to follow through with the arrows. Yeah, Arrow Joe also kind of coming Ooh, up from behind. Well, Taki got, takes out Peter Scraps. Peter Scraps got Gerardi and then arrowed. I'm pretty sure that does oh, a very good damage. So that would have been a good kill either way. A nice That's little ow in chat from Peter Scraps as well. No. <laughs> <laughs> the blue has captured the control point first. Oh, the initial Ooh, cap. gonna crater. After getting launched by Happy Purple. Um, more taking a bit of damage as well. Nice finish from Happy Purple getting that uh, sticky splash on the ramp. Uh, he seems to be behind Blue, but he's super suspicious and he's been pissed on and wiped out by Grandpa with the, with the uh, gunslinger. Not being able to wreak any havoc from behind. Oh, well, Brock Blue. Tato. Oh, Tato, Blue has your move right well. now. Uh, considering how, how much popping there is going on point, well, there's not a huge number of players on either team left uh, out there. Uh, it, it is a uh, win save yourself mode right now. Every bad for himself sort of stuff going on. And Nizek, I think, probably going to be the last of the uh, last of the survivors to go down during that little uh, exchange right there. Uh, Blue are taking up encampment on the point, although sentry gun and the dispenser goes down to the rockets of Benny. Uh, they're having none of it. It is their point, and they are looking to collect the rent. Well, sadly, I'm broke. They're going to have to come back next week. All right, fair enough. Can't be helped. Yeah, that happens. You know why I'm broke? Because I donate a special effect. All my savings, all of them. Excellent. Delightful. You can type my information right donate, and there'll be a link. To donate all of your savings? <laughs> I don't recommend it, but please. It happens again. He just got some dies to an arrow, and I think it was a mini crit. It, it was, was a flaming arrow of, of doom. There was, and uh, he was pissed on as well, I think. Yeah, that's... It, was, uh, it does so much damage. It does. It's a... It's a... Fucking, it's a... Blum, a, a flaming. Excuse me. Flaming. Excuse my language. It is an absolutely flaming... Devastating uh, projectile. That's right. all I had to say on it. <laughs> it's good to see uh, Sergeant Franco looking after his engineer right there. Uh, a good a bit of uh, sandwich exchange going on on the points. Uh, speaking of exchange, uh, there comes the pop of the pyro. So the, the pop of the medic. Uh, that is uh, Oost not willing to, to let his Uber go to waste. Yeah, good point control by them. That was a, a good Uber charge. Getting players in there. Also, Mort getting pretty far forward without any support and uh, even had Lazy Purple behind him. So that was kind of easy clean up for uh, Lazy. Uh, speaking oh, of cleaning up, yep. Yeah, yeah, Peter went down to Lazy Purple finishing off that damage there. Uh, got Yan lining up an arrow, not hitting anything. Zulu jumping down just in time. So it's like it's spilling some stuff. It's getting destroyed immediately. And he gets wiped out by Lazy Purple. Well, Lazy Purple also takes out Pyro Joe. And more. Oh, wow. Yeah, triple kill oh. right there on the seven kill streak. And Utaki gets a headshot on Sergeant Pinecone. Clearly, he kills Lazy Purple. Zulu Man kills Ben. Everything's going down. But Blue Team does ultimately still have control of the point. Yeah, they finally get Lazy Purple, but this is a little bit more reminiscent of what was happening on uh, Product with Peter Scraps just going down. And then the, they're pushing forward and they're pushing into Uber Charges, and then you're not going to be able to survive yourself. And then the cycle repeats as they get an Uber Charge before you. So Peter uh, Scraps has to watch out a bit, but, you know, at least... Speaking of which, uh, Blue did pop the painting there. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. 
good he was trying to walk along the point, but he got tagged by some minigun bullets by mistake, and uh, he ends up getting piped, unfortunately. Very bad luck. Mm, Zulu uh, Man, a uh, nice bomb over the top here. Peter scraps 75%, but able to dodge a good amount of that uh, damage. The uh, heavy being Jurati, though, means that he won't be able to win a one on one versus Circuit. Pressure on uh, Peter Scraps and the other players. Lacey, Lacey uh, Purple coming in from behind. Gets Peter Scraps again. Ouch. It's a bad day to be Peter Scraps right now. The oh, counter man. is going down. They only have to hold this uh, for a few more moments. It looks like they're not going to have an opportunity. Oh, big deal. Weapon two backstab attempts. Again, wiped out. Sergeant Pine Corner gunning down. Seeing Rich before he can get in. However, there is a blue Uber. They are pushing back and they are not going to capture this. Not much Red can do other than go balls to the wall again and just run in. They are yeah, on good, overtime. Good dodges from O's there to uh, get away from that post Uber just fine. And uh, yeah, overtime ticking away. Peter Scraps goes down. More nice bomb from underneath. Followed by a bomb from Benny. Chloe Mew here as well. Uh, no, too many so players from the sleep squad. They're up 2 1 now on match point. Oh, what a turnaround this has been. We've been underplaying this. I mean, this is the third and final map. This is the decider. That whoever wins this is can hold their hands high uh, and proud and, and be the winners of the 2019 TF Connect Highlander Tournament. Uh, Two-day tournament. Uh, and, uh, and right now, I, I think both teams need to realize that, that there is there is a lot to play for. There is the the winner versus loser. I mean, one team will be awesome, and the other team will be wet and cold and miserable and without friends. Uh, nobody will love the losers. It's the battle for the bragging rights, really. I mean, obviously, there's there's that. That's epic gamer stats. That's what they're after here. I, I, I can imagine only that the the uh, trading uh, they've got uh, cards uh, each holding 50 YouTube followers uh, on the table of this gamble right now, uh, and uh, and the winner walks away with a contract by Nike. I I, I don't know. N none of these things are true. Um, just pointing it out. None of them are true. But what is true uh, is the immediate death uh, of the entirety of Blue Team. Yeah, uh, it certainly looks like it. Almost entirely wiped out. Got Grandpa looking back with a dribble of health. Uh, old Tacky at the back of his huntsman yet again, trying to get some uh, cheeky shots through onto point. Is he going to hit anything? No, he he's going to hit Sergeant. On. Yeah, he hit Sergeant okay. Pine Cone there. Yeah, doesn't kill him though. He's going to need to hit those headshots. Benny narrowly avoiding a shot there, and Yan trying to fire back some arrows. It's a Not much ball. happening. It's a Huntsman board. It's a, it's a showdown. That's it. That's how Huntsman works, and that's why I love it so much. Well, Taki gets the headshot with Venus Scraps, just saying that now. Ooh. Ooh. Eskies also a massive 50% advantage. Hopefully, he can hold it up long enough to use it and cause a bit of disruption right now uh, because uh, they are more than uh, two points, uh, more than one point away, I should say, from winning this. Uh, they need to, to get their action on right now. Definitely, but it looks like Blue is taking control of this point again. Uh, Morris going for it, and he gets wiped out immediately. Benny's popping onto the supply crates and gets wiped out immediately. Chloe Mute is underneath in the banana tunnel, as we have been calling it. Peter Scraps is hanging back a little bit, but he's been spotted. I think it's probably going to try and get reach around. It looks like Proctor's behind. He's beefed it, shot. The Peter Scraps said, turn around this time, but he gets butter knife. The one time he turned around and was aware. Oh, it's such a shame. He doesn't get to live and he dies again. Lisa Purple is behind wrecking havoc. Takes out Chloe Mew. And Blue maintains ultimate control. Sergeant Pinko's on his own. He's not going to be able to do anything. It wiped out as well. The whole team. Just Nyan has switched back to sniper rifle. There's no more Huntsman. They've been so solid up to this point, and it looks like that they're kind of like ignoring the fact that they have this massive advantage and uh, and pushing in one at a time. Oh my goodness me! There goes Nyan. Takes out Zulu Man. Please, Blue Team, don't drop it. Push on. Take the take the opportunity. Blow this Uber and get some decent kills under your belt. Yeah, I know. Instead, they're just gonna get pressured um, from above with uh, Benny, and you know it does turn into a mostly useless uh, Uber. You're invulnerable for a couple seconds, you know, that's cool, but you're supposed to use it to uh, take objectives or, you know, really you don't want to use it just to save your medic for a couple seconds. Versi right, sneaks in and kills Serka and slinks away before any damage is done. Doing a spice job, getting a little pick and getting out of there. 
There's a little battle happening on point here. Sergeant Pinkhorn with Peter Scraps firmly planted up his backside with a medigun. Mars throwing some grenades over. Uh, I believe we just got a, a donation, actually. Uh, if Ooh. someone else would like to take over just for a moment while I check that out. Yeah, red team getting on the point here, getting the capture. Peter Scraps in a little bit of danger, very low health, has the charge. Just backing up kind of completely into banana, though. As uh, Benny goes down, and uh, again, you know, you want to use charge, charges going forward. I'm um, not just kind of completely stuck backwards. We'll see if they will be able to get forward and make that happen. Lazy purple uh, poking from underneath a little bit. Uh, ends up backing up, though. Uh, the donation was from Insomnia. Uh, thank you very much for the $10 raise queue, which is an adorable dog emote, which I've seen in millions of places. Honestly, that is bugging me. Where do I get that? I want it. Mm, so doggy. Look, at look at the doggy. Look at the doggy. Look at but anyway, red, red team has the point. I looked away looking at the donations and suddenly red's back in the back in the seat. Yeah, this has been a good round for him. They're playing it very strong. Um, you know, just gotten a lot of control over the point and uh, forward pressure in front of it, which is important. Um, I'm not sure if Mort may be playing a little bit tighter than um, uh, yeah, getting super aggro, but yeah, it looks like Neon goes down. Uh, Ubercharge has come out against some sort of early half it done before they get to the point. Yeah, not a huge amount of a win without that overcharge. Uh, not necessarily a loss, Ooh, though. Ooh, Versi gets a backstab on the Medic and the Heavy and gets wow. out of there. Wow, wow. yeah. More, more with a huge cleanup there as well. Versity on a four-kill streak, but Mer Ooh. Mer Ooh. getting three on the point. That was a spicy one. Nice turnaround right there. Something them capping, meaning the timer still counts down for Red Team. This could go to a 2-2 final round showdown. The ultimate showdown. Yeah. yeah, Red Red's certainly in a good space for this here. Zulu Man getting killed by a trap from Mort as well. Versus they do more stabs. Happy Purple and Grandpa standing in the corner as well. Might even be able to sneak out another one. Sees Ost. He's going to decloak by the uh, dispenser. Oh, Lazy Purple just yeah. made on point on time, but walks off! They walked off and lost to the C9. And that makes the score 2 2 for this map. This is absolutely, this is insane. This is, this Dear is, Lord, the, this the, is actually whoever, insane. Whoever wins this wins the whole thing. Yeah, down to <laughs> the wire. Oh, it's 2-2. Two, two. Let's go. We're rolling out now. Here we are. Happy Purple rolling forward. I think he's going to be the first to make it to point. He is. He's throwing some uh, pills out there to try and deter any pursuers. However, Red has actually moved on there. However, Pierce got mm. his headshot. The Huntsman by Altaki, Lazy Purple takes out Sir Duck, Pro Protato gets two backstabs and guns down someone else. Uh, like Red Team's having to reset here that. already. It looks, yeah, it looks like this entire, like the blue team just kind of said, like, we're done now. You, you've had your fun. Alright, uh, we gave you hope. We're taking yeah. it back. Goodbye. <laughs> Sit down, kid. This is how we really do it. Dear That's Lord, that is terrifying. But they've been pushed all the way back to their spawn now, so that that really is a, a very decisive uh, maneuver by them. Uh, so much can happen at this mid area. You really have to, if you're going to assert dominance, you have to do it from the enemy's side of the map. Definitely yeah, that one. For sure, it's good to get forward. Ooh, and uh, right now, want to help a backstab from Taylor there. The heavy ran past him. He 180 him and just absolutely annihilated him. That was, and also gone down Peter Scrap, so Peter Scrap has to reset yet again. Uh, ultimately, it looks like the team are holding this point. Absolutely no problems whatsoever. A few losses here and there. Literally just a couple. They've lost their medic as well, however, they do still have the player advantage. Yeah, if you want to be following somebody right now, it, it's it's Lazy Purple. It seems to be always out there, always in the action, and always getting the kills. Uh, at least finishing them off. Uh, that That is one classy player we're seeing right there. Yeah, that is really how it feels to dominate the battlefield. Uh, Proctato again, a backstab on Pyro Joe as well, who I think was playing Scout. Versity taking out the sentry and dispenser. Pierce Scraps goes down again. Yeah, okay. Zulu Man had put down a lot of damage on Peter Scraps um, from the container. But yeah, Lazy Purple is just running around crazily. Yeah, it's definitely like um, product where if you just let that scout get behind you and you're not really checking where he is, 
There's just so many players that are kind of weak that just all of a sudden you got a scout coming up behind you and meat shotting you. It's very dangerous. And uh, Lazy Purple has been doing a great job of playing that role on this map. Might even get Peter Scraps here again. Has he got oh. a seven kill streak? Because that is uh, not it's already eight kill streak. He's just and he's picked off, yeah, for the second time. And there goes uh, Versity again. So Lazy Purple's definitely been crushing it. Um, and I mean, the, the rounds that he's turning up, it's just he's easy mode for uh, Sleep that. Squad. Oh, yeah, he's just like, oh, 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 so close to a 10 kill streak. I've noticed yeah, that Lazy Purple dude. has been dominating the uh, tunnels underneath as well to get behind the enemies. Yeah, so it's. It's one of those weird locations that you think there's no point trying to attack from there. It's always going to be well defended, but if it's not, then you can really make use of it. Right, there, there, are, there are three paths here to get to mid or to get around mid or to get onto the other new teams. And, and or actually four, if you think about the, the stuff above. Yeah, I mean, it, it's impossible to be on guard of all of them all the time. Uh, without spreading your team so wildly. Look, an Uber has been blown by a blue team. It was a defensive Uber. They're going to try and go out and, and make something from this. Yeah, it's pretty strong Uber charge. Oh, yeah, Benny the, on point. Where the clock is at. Benny on the point, but he's not really getting much uh, capture time. The frags going forward were very strong. And uh, Sleep Squad, they're just going to be able to get the finish off here on point, clear everybody off. They'll get the capture in perfect form up. on that final round. Three full minutes of control, taking the championship of TF Connect 2019. I just want to say, like, they rolled the sleeves up on that last round. They absolutely dominated out of nowhere. That was terrifying. That was like playing with a completely different team. What, was, what on earth happened? I was half joking when I said that they were, like, like, just chilling and relaxing and letting the other team get a point, sir. But I, I, I'm slightly I thinking now, like maybe. <laughs> yeah. Now that is a possibility. They were kicking back, relaxing, thinking, yeah, no, we'll get I them think, hope. We'll get I that think, glint in their eyes. I want to see it extinguished. I think in a few days from now, we're going to see uh, we're going to see a few YouTube video, uh, a POV videos uh, with some cameras on on uh, on on mice and keyboards uh, where they they'd kind of swap their hands over to see if they could still play and defeat this team. Because uh, when they of put course. it around the way that it should be, my goodness me, that team just destroyed. Absolutely, that was. I'm honestly scared. I'm I'm terrified of this. What What did I just? That was absolutely murderous. Yeah. But, uh, we're gonna hop over and start doing some interviews now with some of the players. I'm so keen to get Lazy Purple's point of view on this. Happy and Lazy, both of the purples we have with us right Hello. now. Best color. Hello, by the way. Happy Purple, uh, can I get a word from you before we uh, jump over to Lazy? Uh, how did it feel to dominate so completely on that map? Pretty great, pretty great. Uh, were, were you guys kind of like hanging out and not really trying your best until that last round? Uh, no, we were, we were trying, we were trying. Oh really? Okay, right, I'm going to take it back then. Uh, uh, excellent work, well done, congratulations on winning all of the things. Uh, are you are you I don't, Hold on, I don't hear the sweat dripping down that brow. <laughs> I think you're lying to us right now. I'm sweating for the bo I'm sweating for the both of us here. Oh nice. wow, that like genuinely like I want to quickly hop over to Lazy Purple as well. How many times did you almost hit? And even I think one of the times you did hit a ten kill streak. Uh, yeah, one time I, I got the tenor, and then I think one I got like nine or yeah, eight. Yeah, nine died for really, yeah. Yeah. That is honestly incredible. Like, genuinely, like you, I noticed you took a lot of time going behind the enemy like a scout really should. Like, like 100%. Well, for it's, I actually, I have a bit of a bad habit doing that. Um, And the only reason I got away with it is because Zulu, my soldier, was uh, apparently very hardly focusing the mini sentries and um, giving the engineer a really hard time. And that opened up all that space for me to do uh, scout stuff that oh, scout yeah. shouldn't get away with. Yeah, there was a lot of harassment on the engine. I realized that he was uh, running the mini sentry as well, which would have absolutely melted any scouts. However, of course, like you said, with the soldier running that, uh, running that sentry to the ground, it wouldn't have done much. Ah, brilliant. Mor Mort's here. We've we've got someone from the other team, so it's not not completely biased, just mostly. Uh, Mort, hi. We will find out what Mort has to uh, say on this uh, <laughs> when Mort finds his voice. Shoot him um, next time. Lazy Dragon purple. Ball Z. Uh, 
I want to quickly find out uh, who would win in a fight between you and JPEG. Oh, that's a scary one. Um, hmm. <laughs> hmm. JPEG wasn't how, even how in much, this match. Uh, how much warm up do I get? How much warm up? I think the the two of you. Uh, I think we want to see you this. You both like, have the same. You you you're both going to be on on your own uh, in in location as yet to be determined. Uh, one year from now. Oh, one year from now. Oh, I think I can take him on. Oh really? Ooh. Right, right now I think he might he might get the better of me. But if if I if I was in a dojo for a year with just a PC doing MG scout for a year, <laughs> I, I think I might catch up. Okay, that's that's how much of a difference it is. Mort, uh, are you are you able to do the words thing? Would it be easier to type? I can relay your words if preferred. We would like to hear your uh, your input. They might Beautiful be struggling voice. Struggling with their push to talk. I'm not sure. It's it's not. Just it's push not, all the buttons. Just 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 hammer them all like you're playing. Start, d don't press Smash. the power button. Get, like take my word for it. Don't press that one. That turns it off. Can confirm. What are you talking about? Does it? The the power button. Yeah. Like, try it. Try it, Agro. Go on. Try it I'm right now. I'm doing it now. I'm pressing it. it, it. Pressing it. No, nothing's happening. All right, guys. Thank you very much for what. <laughs> 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 that was a good one. Oh, hello. I hello. Can Oh, there we go. There's someone from Hello. the team that like, can. That's it's, fortunately uh, not happening. Can you hear me now? <laughs> it's my mic. Yeah, working. there's more as well. Yeah, was, so, yay. Uh, Chloe, yay. Chloe, Hello. more. How how did both of you feel about that match? That, that was, was very, very fun. close. <laughs> was well, very I'm gonna fun. gonna interrupt the interview just for a moment. It looks like we've got a donation of fifty Canadian dollars mm -hmm. uh, from someone. If you give me a moment, I'll find out who it was. But uh, well, I look for that. Uh, yeah. Any questions you guys want to ask? Yeah, no, exactly. Uh, Chloe, Mew, I, I know you guys did incredibly well in that uh, in that uh, second map. Um, yeah, we pulled through. You you actually pulled through. You you you, you did the winning thing. Is is that the good feels? Yes. I uh, mean, I kept saying we had like the ping disadvantage. It wasn't that much of a disadvantage. It just meant that timings for certain things were thrown off a bit. But so I think you, we did well. Was it possible that you you won through lag alone? <laughs> I think there were some points where a rocket had gone past me on my screen, but I was still able to reflect it. So, I mean, it counts. I didn't uh, see the odd reflect coming from you. I was yeah. trying to point that out, but at the same time, there was a lot happening there. That was quite a match. I'm quite proud of that reflect where the soldier shot a rocket at me and I reflected it into his medic, who was like miles away wow. from him. Wow. Oh, that is beautiful. It didn't kill him, but it was satisfying. I'm just, sure it was completely deliberate as well. Yes, what, yes, what? absolutely. Well, no, no, I did aim it. I did aim it. Right, okay, no, no that counts then. It's definitely yeah, yeah. No, yes. no, we, we believe you. <laughs> you aimed it, yes, of course, Chloe. Uh, but I want to chime in quickly. It was from Proctato, those $50. Uh, love what you do. Had fun playing Spy. It was absolutely wonderful commentating that match, Proctato. Thank you very much for the donation. Uh, Mar, how about you? How did you feel about that match? It was very fun. I didn't expect it to be so tight. Yeah, uh, like, yeah. honestly, it was like a back and forth. We... We thought you were going to get rolled at the end there, then you pulled it back for another point. It was down to the final round. Honestly, it was absolutely incredible from both teams, yet again. Yeah, I did underestimate the ping disadvantage a lot in my pipes. I just didn't hit any pipes on Lazy Purple whatsoever. You I tried my hardest. You still did manage to do quite a few cleanups, though, especially on point. You did really well, genuinely. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, projectiles That's the only on compliment high ping are really me. janky. <laughs> That's the only compliment I'm giving. The rest of you smell. <gasps> Especially Chloe. No, you. <gasps> you take that back. <laughs> but anyway, too far. Um, any more questions? Uh, maybe from Eckstein or Agro? Oh, no. Just happy to have everybody here. It was fun uh, watching your guys' match. No, of course. Wonderful. Uh, I believe we're going to have some more uh, interviews from some of the... Really? Uh, s yeah. It, from, it's getting... Uh, it's getting busy yeah. in here. All right. Uh, I'll tell you what. Uh, happy Purple, Easy Purple. Anyone you guys want to shout out? Oh, just um, uh, the whole team. Everyone gave their best, and I'm really proud of the result. And the enemy team put up an amazing fight, and that was honestly everything I could ask for out of uh, this event. So thank you, everyone. Awesome. What about yourself, Happy Purple? Uh, yeah, pretty much what he said. The, the enemy teams, they were just fantastic. I, I, it was really fun playing against them. They were really good. That's Can I just ask before fantastic. the two of you leave? Are you related in any way? Or is it just... <laughs> no. <laughs> no, it's just uh, purple's a good color. Well, how can, can you blame us?
And I it's mean, just lazy purple on two separate PCs with different microphones. Green <laughs> <laughs> is better. Right, Ooh, you, well, all right, get Chloe Mew out. She's not going to do any shout outs. What about oh, yellow? Controversial yellow note. Right, Chloe. Right, but anyway, yeah, Chloe. Uh, sorry, I got that means to cut you off. Would you like to take it? No, no, I was going to ask uh, Chloe. Anyone, anyone you want to give a shout out to? Uh, any, any group? Any uh, small uh, denomination? Or any, any colony? Uh, your mum. <laughs> I d- I never know who to say this. My mind just goes blank. I just want just everyone who participates in these. Everyone who sets these up. We man- we raise a lot of money for like really good causes. I think it's really great that everyone just comes together and you know just does all this. That's absolutely lovely. <laughs> absolutely beautiful. Uh, who else? More? Do you have anyone you would like to shout out? Uh, I'll I'll like to shout out Happy Purple and Lazy Purple's utter confusion of me yesterday, where I generally <laughs> thought they were the same person and I never saw. What it means. <laughs> <laughs> I was very confused to discover that wasn't the case, and I was just like, okay, this yeah, makes sense we, now. We we couldn't afford that kind of CGI, I'm afraid. Not like with uh, Pyro Joe and uh, Spiky Mikey. Oh yeah. Yeah, we we ran out of money halfway through that render. Uh, but uh, thank you, you four. We're gonna have you as escorted out by our security team 